6.20 in the morning on Monday morning. This is the day of our Florida flight. Are you ready for Florida? Are you ready for Florida? Are you ready for Florida? Yeah. Checked in. I am so relieved. Like my heart was pounding in that cube. I feel like strangely happy and not stressed. <laughs> Are you ready to go on the aeroplane? Frankie's laughing at him. You're excited. You're excited. Mr. G is traveling in a luxury. Whenever you plan on flying to Florida, don't fly into Orlando. We've been in the queue for an hour and we still have only like one tenth of the way to you. That was the longest queue I've ever gotten in my life. There were kids in the queue, there were babies in the queue. It was ridiculous. Steph actually complained because it was just so ridiculous. So in the end we did get to skip the queue, but we already had to queue for like two hours. And Mr. G went a bit mental, didn't ya? He's very delirious right now, it's about five hours past his nap time. But we're here and we just can't wait to get into our flat and see our home for the next month. Please stand clear of course and hold on to the handrails. The shuttle will be departing home. We just picked up our car, check it out. I don't know what it is, it's some weird American thing. I have no idea. What, oh, it's a Ford. But it looks like no Fords we have in England at all. I think it's like 1am 1, 1 in England right now, so this feels really wrong having like takeout. out. McDonald's in America tastes better. And maybe because we're starving to death. We've got a two hour drive to get back. This bloody bug making my life hell. They're not going to charge me a hundred dollars, are they? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. We just drove past a Walmart and I got a little bit excited because mm. I've always seen Walmart on t TV shows and so I kind of want to go there, which is a little bit sad because I think it's just a supermarket, isn't it? We're here. This is our home for the next month. One of these buildings somewhere. We just got a building on the left. So it must be this one up here. Can you hear the beach just down that way as well? Oh, yeah, let's go and check this place out. So, oh, God knows which key it is. Ah. We're in. Yeah. Ooh, this is nice. Look at that big bed. Oh, we did it, we did it. Oh, thank God we're here. It's our first morning in Florida. Check out the view from the balcony. It is insane. I'm pretty happy that this is going to be our home for the next month. It's the beach. 
trying to entertain Jeffy while I unpack. Piled up all the teddies on it. Steph just popped over to the gym with one of his friends, so me and Jeffy are just unpacking. Jeffy is happily watching some kind of like weird cartoon right now. He looks pretty at the pool Hello! You need a nap, don't you? What cartoons are you watching? I piled up all your toys on you and you threw them all away, didn't you? <laughs> you need a nap, Jane. You know what? Do you like Florida? Do you like Florida? That's all I've brought for a month. It doesn't seem like a lot, does it? But that's all I could fit in and we had these two massive bags. But I'm pretty happy with the makeup station that I've got for the month, look. Ta-da! It's pretty cool. And then I just unpacked some makeup things there. I actually miss Steph while he's out as well, which is really stupid because we're with each other like 24-7. We don't there's never a time when we're not together unless he is at the gym or like seeing friends or something. But um yeah. I miss him. Come home, Steffi. Come to the beach for an evening stroll. It's six o'clock and it's still really, really nice and warm. And um, Grayson's just had his little nap, so we thought we'd finish the day by just having a nice little walk along here. just off to go and find a supermarket so we can stock up for the week, aren't we Jaffy? This is my favourite little outfit of Jaffy's because he just looks so cute in it. He kind of looks like a little girl but you know, doesn't matter does it? We're going to go and find a Whole Foods or something now so we can go and get some nappies and some lunch and that kind of thing and then I think we're probably going to go for a swim. My tennis card over there. Yes it is, my tennis card. <laughs> Jeffy doesn't seem to mind his car seat anymore because he's realised that he can see me from. Please drive to the highlighted route. He can see me from the um, the back seat anyway, and in our car at home, he can't really see. You're looking pretty happy, aren't you? Sat there with your bunny. Sat there with your bunny friend. restaurant and we're going to stop for some lunch. You're being very good considering it's your bedtime right now. Oh, oh yeah! Oh. Yeah! Yeah! Good boy! Oh. Oh. <laughs> we're in Hoffman's! I think it's really good. I think Steph's already been distracted by something. The thing I love about Whole Foods is that there's just samples of stuff everywhere so you can just come here and eat. We're gonna be losers and have an early night and watch Game of Thrones. Those sweet potatoes are the biggest I have ever it's seen. It's so hard to do this. I know, I'll do it for you now. Stop it. How sad is it that I actually want to buy this cereal because it's got a lemur on the front? It's like my inner child just came out. I feel like such a 
such an American carrying a bag of groceries in a big paper bag. Don't you see it in all the movies, don't you? Steph's at the gym this morning and Mr G is having his morning nap. So I thought I would take advantage and get a little bit of sunbathing in because I haven't been able to sunbathe for so long and I actually forgot how much I enjoyed it. Last time we came to America I was actually pregnant so I couldn't sunbathe because you're not really supposed to. Um, so this is like a little bit of heaven to me, my 20 minute morning sunbathe while Mr G naps. Probably going to burn my bum on this chair though. Oh, I just found a hole in my bum of my trousers. Can I get away with wearing these still? I think, I think so. I think it'll be all right. We're all gonna hop in the car now and we're gonna go over to Miami house and go for a swim, maybe have a couple of drinks. G-Man in Miami. Party all night till the break of dawn. Just uh, chilling. I'm loading Miami and we're just having a coffee. Thought I'd bring him along. Then turn left on North SRA 1A. Every time I put the camera on, the bloody sat nav starts talking over me. We're. Come on. Oh, shut up. <laughs> we are on our way right now. To... Turn left on North oh, SRA 1A. So annoying. We're on our way right now to Walmart. Oh, I'm really excited. Um, it's a really dumb thing to be excited about because I know it's just a supermarket. I have right seen it in so many Jam like Road American East. TV shows. They always go to Walmart, so I think it's gonna be a bit depressing. I think it probably will be too. I reckon but we're in the we um, we need to go there and get Jeffy a cheap little travel push chair because we didn't bring a push chair with us. It's day three now, and we kind of like both getting sore arms from carrying him because he's pretty big and heavy. Hopefully we'll be able to find something in there. I'm excited about the experience anyway, and are you? Um, I reckon it's going to be soul crushing. Walmart is absolutely gigantic. We're just looking for the baby section and there's like so much random stuff here. It's such a weird supermarket. These push chairs are so ugly. The cheapest one we can find is like $20 and obviously we're gonna leave it here when we go back to England anyway. But it's bright green Disney with a bigger alien eye on the front of it. I don't want people to think that I actually picked it because I liked it. We found a black one, yeah, we didn't have to get the ugly green one. Which I'm very happy about. Spent the last 20 minutes in a Walmart putting together and assembling a cheap push chair. Probably one of the worst experiences of my life. So what do you think of Walmart, Coney? Um, it's exactly like you said, it's kind of something just from Walmart. We're at Miami House, yay! Did you like Miami Beach House? We are just on our way back to Florida now and we had such a good day at Miami Beach House that we are going to come back for the weekend probably next weekend. Jeffy's been a little bit whingy this morning and Steph's out of the gym so I'm just going to take him for a little walk in his push chair. <laughs> I think he's just really overtired. I can see him shuffling around in his push chair. Are you ready to go for a walk? Yeah? <laughs> Good boy! I don't know this area at all, so I think we're just going to go for a little stroll around the building because otherwise I'm going to get lost. Found a park! just got home 
home. That was such a nice way to start the day. It's such a beautiful walk and I'm so glad I went out to explore. Now, Steph and I are gonna take Jeffy to a baby music class with Steph's friend and his little boy. Which should be interesting because I've never taken Jeffy to any of these little baby classes before and I've always wanted to, so see how he gets on at baby music. Hey, you wanna go to baby music now? Should we get you changed because you're a bit grubby? Did you like your walk? Did you like your walk? Yeah? Jeffy is prototyping a few of... Oh, that stupid thing, it's so annoying. <laughs> Jeffy's wearing an outfit today that we're gonna be selling in our shop next month and so he is testing it out and we just wanna make sure that it wears well and it washes well and that there's nothing awkward about it before we put it up because we want it to be really perfect. Um, Continue but he's... 550 meters, then turn left on North SRA1A. He's wearing it now with his little moccasins and he looks so cute. Say hello. I'm wearing my bicycle uh, trousers and my uh, matching bicycle t-shirt, designed by Grayson Perry, so... Oh, it was designed by Grayson Perry, wasn't it? The, the print was, yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> But it was still really fun, like the kids in there were so cute. Gracie at first didn't quite know what to make of it and whenever they started to sing he cried which was a little bit embarrassing but kind of funny at the same time. But then he got used to it and he seemed to really like it after that. He was kind of like really attracted by all the bright colours and the singing and everything so I think I might take him to a baby one, like a proper baby one. As soon as we got him into the car he fell asleep, look. Sleepy. That's the end of the first week in Florida. We are just about over the jet lag now. It's taken about five days for us to get over it, but we've had the most amazing week and we are really loving life out in Florida right now. I think the worst part about the trip for us was the fact that we were both quite pessimistic about what could have gone wrong on the way over because obviously if you watch the last vlog in Santorini you'll know that quite a lot of things went wrong. We turned up to the airport the wrong day and all of that kind of thing so we we're both quite stressed about travelling this time but it went absolutely fine. Grayson was really well behaved, I was so surprised because I was quite nervous about doing a nine hour flight with him but he was an absolute angel, I couldn't have asked for a better behaved baby. He's actually just been amazing for this whole trip, he's really adapted well to the change in time and the climate change and everything which I was really nervous about and I just thought it was going to be a lot more stressful than it was but it's actually just been really chilled out and yeah, Grayson's just been amazing. Steph being away at his meetings and everything, it really gives me a chance to be on my own with Grayson and just really reflect about how appreciative I am to even be here because both Steph and I grew up quite poor and I just never thought that I would get the opportunity to come and live somewhere like this for a whole month. Like, I just didn't think I would ever be able to do that. So it's like the tiny details that both of us really appreciate and enjoy. I think I'm rambling so I hope you guys all enjoyed watching our first week in Florida and thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. We'll see you all for next week, our second week in Florida. Bye!